the intersection. How many phone booths do they really need? Whoa. That bus is so old. What am I even looking at? And all these cars are so blocky. They look so weird. like that before they're just like in those retro videos I've seen under the Showa era tag this is kind of surreal even the stoplights here are huge stop wandering off on your own Kisaraki wait okay for real though they seriously haven't invented smartphones yet <laughs> this is so crazy how do they even talk to each other? <sighs> Whoa. Oh, oh my god. We really are in the 80s. I can't believe that hair. What? <laughs> Sorry, I just can't stop laughing. <gasps> what even is that? A pompadour? The show air is so weird. What the hell are you laughing at? Huh? Your hair, duh. I just said. You trying to start shit? <laughs> what even is the sh- What the- Huh? Your hair- You tr- Please excuse us. I'm afraid she's a little... Well... She has difficulty with social interaction. Hey! Don't make me sound like some kind of weirdo. Please, carry on. I'll give her a talking to once we're home. <sighs> Goddamn freaks. Well, there goes my Stop day. Stop causing problems. You realize we're only here with the help of this era's facilitators. If we're to be accepted here, we must respect the place. We're essentially foreign refugees. Don't forget that. Facilitators. So, about those facilitators. You mean Shikishima? The military corporation? All they care about is getting their hands on future technology. You sure we're not being used? That is not your concern. I remember seeing that company in the news back in 2025. They make everything from fridges to missiles. They've got tons of factories across the world. Sakura High. I trust you know where to find it? It's the same school. I expect you'll adjust quickly. That is not my school. Everyone from that class is old enough to be my mom. Don't act like it's the same. We left mine back in 2025. So in 2025, I would have turned 16 next month. But now, I'm way back in 1985. So like, how old am I, technically? Take me back to my own time. I thought I explained this already. The world was destroyed. Okay, fine, let's say that's true. I've still gotta go help my mom and dad. They won't be there. It's already too late. I doubt you'd get the clearance to time jump anyway. That another one of their orders? I didn't want to get dragged into this. Am I supposed to just take it? Whatever you say? Precisely. You should count yourself lucky to have escaped with us. I never saw it myself. The world was destroyed, apparently. What do I even say to that? Yeah, cool. Got it. Still. Even if I begged to go check it out, something tells me they aren't gonna let me. What I need is a little leverage over them. I gotta make them an offer they can't refuse. Until further notice, here are your orders. Do not act on your own. Remain inconspicuous. And for now, simply attend school as usual. Am I clear?
Usami-chan, did you check out all those books? What are they? Hey, do you mind if I take a look? They're not that interesting. I just want to peek. Let's see. Business quarterly? Corporate guides. Economic reports. This is impressive, Usami-chan. Are you studying for a career in business? Uh, not really. I was kind of looking for some leverage. You know, dirt on some big shady corporation. So then I could, like, control them a little. Huh? Usami-chan, that's a little... weirder than I was expecting. I could do this in a snap if I had internet here. Manually searching through books? So inconvenient. Internet? Uh, oh, uh, like, you know, net profits, big business talk, <laughs> or something. I've been meaning to tell you. I found a cafe with some amazing looking cakes. Shall we go there after school? Sounds good. Those crepes from yesterday are gonna be hard to beat, though. Back home, they went a little too crazy with the toppings. Sometimes simple is best. Check her out. How does one person sleep that much? Hmm, good point. Crepes would be nice, too. Do you think we could get both? I scoured the whole library for reference materials. Wasn't hard to find things on Shikishima, but... It's just like... Stock market stuff. I should have known. Nothing I could use as leverage. Shikishima Industries. You know anything about them? Shikishima. They're the ones who make ships and things, right? Hmm. I have this old friend. His father works for them, I think. Seriously? Miwako, can you do me a favor? I want you to introduce me. Sure. Yes. Those big megacorps always have shady stuff hiding in their HQ. One step closer to getting the dirt. goes to the school, right? They're still not here. Did you get the meeting time wrong? No. Did they just ditch? Don't worry, he'll be here soon. He's not the type to break promises. What's up? <laughs> I'm here. It's that Pompadour guy! What's he doing here? This is my old friend, Nanji Ogata. You're kidding. So, uh, where's she at? You said some girl was looking to ask me out? What? Well, um, that would be her, Usami-chan. Huh? You're the chick who shat on my hair. Real dog face, aren't you? The heck is that supposed to mean? I take it you're not calling me a cute puppy. Okay, hold on. What did you say to this guy? Just that a girl I knew wanted to tell him something. And he thought 
thought that was a confession? How dumb is he? I'm standing right here. Why'd it have to be you? The feeling's mutual, man. Please, can't we all calm down? There you are. I've been looking all over for you. What was... I just saw them. Usami-chan! Usami-chan! <sighs> oh, good. You weren't waking up. I thought you might have died. What just happened? I don't know. There was some kind of flash, and... Then we were here. Damn it. Still alive over there, Captain Pompadour? My name... is Nenji Ogata. Get it straight, dogface. Oh, excuse me, Captain Pompadour. I'm Tomi Kisaragi. Don't give me any stupid nicknames. All right, smartass. Please, we can't be fighting right now. <sighs> what happened to all these buildings? It's like... We were attacked. <sighs> Do you know something? I know the city got leveled. You saw that flash, right? Must have been a nuke. Uh, a nuclear bomb? You realize we were at school just now. Isn't this downtown? Way I figure it. The blast must have knocked us all the way over here. Okay, never mind. You're just a moron. Hey! You're like a big, greasy roach. I bet you could survive a nuke no problem. <sighs> you got a better idea? What the hell else could have happened? Oh. If we're here, then... No way. If it's nuclear war, then that means... There's radiation everywhere! We're going to die! We have to run, or get cover, or... Deep breaths, Miwako. I'll try. This is... Keakicho. Huh? Oh, you're right! Look at that sign! Must be near the shopping district. The hell? You know how far that is from school? Look, I don't know what the hell happened. But nobody else is here. You think they all evacuated? Well, then where? Where's everyone else? Miwako. Dad. Mom. You two know. 
It's hard to tell with everything messed up like this, but I think we're in the year 2025. 2025? Are you crazy? This is my home. Well, was my home, I guess. In case I didn't mention, I came from the future. No matter where I am, at least the sunset is always the same. You can hardly see any stars in this era. Though I have to say, the city lights are a sight to behold. This place isn't too crowded. Gives me room to hang around and think for a bit. Better take advantage of that. Nothing's changed today, either. It hasn't gone anywhere. It's still there, hiding behind all those elaborate curtains. That's Sentinel. It's what brought me here. just the sentinel and I brought here. That thing is beyond me. I'm no expert, but I know it's capable of some extraordinary feats. Time travel, though. Could the sentinel possess an ability like that? Before the war, my uncle gave me a sci-fi novel, a story about traveling through time to the future. It only ever felt like a far-off fantasy. But on that day, at that moment, that fantasy became a reality. Our mother's terrible at sewing, but she made this for Chihiro. I'd never... It's peace to... Even still, Chihiro took it... They came ashore during... During nor... Instead of quiet... It. The store hit only, but on that day.
have reached its operating limit. Where am I? The air raid. Everything was just on fire. All these giant towers with glass windows? What the hell's going on? <sighs> the last thing I remember is being surrounded by those new American weapons and... No. It can't be. I've heard about major U.S. cities. These high-rise buildings are common. Was I captured? And they got my Sentinel too? They must have done it when I lost consciousness. Brought me to the mainland as their... No, wait. If the Sentinel just reached its operating limit, then not very much time could have passed. But this view says otherwise. It's not my homeland. Somehow, I ended up on U.S. soil. If that's the case, fine. I guess this is where I'll die. But I'm not going down without a fight. I'll face the enemy, even without my Sentinel. Uh, the Sentinel. This is bad. The Sentinels are top secret. It can't fall into enemy hands. can't move the Sentinel now since it hit its operating limit. Considering everything it's been through already, I can't expect it to perform at full capacity. Sentinel. The enemy cannot get their hands on the Sentinel. That's the kind of issue that becomes a national crisis. But what can I do? I can't activate now, let alone initiate self-destruct. I need to slow down and think things over. I should probably go lie low until the Sentinel recovers. But not because I'm afraid. My country. My little sister. I'd give my life for them at the drop of a hat. But I have to be smart right now. And that means waiting for the Sentinel to be up and running. Now that I have a plan, I better move fast. I should get out of here before American soldiers show up. I'll stay out of sight until it's the right time to move. Everyone here appears to be Japanese. But something's off. These signs show both kanji and the English alphabet. Ashitaba Printing, Ashitaba Bank. Why are they named after my hometown? You want to stop by the arcade? Sure. The one at Sun Mall? Nah, the one at Joyland. Let's go try out those big new Sega machines that came in. I have no idea what they're talking about, but their language doesn't sound foreign to me. Did you see him in last night's episode? Yeah. Oh, he's so amazing. Right? I watch everything he's in. Female students. Though that's quite a bit of exposed leg. It almost seems like a different dialect. But it's definitely Japanese. seems off. This is all just a terrible dream. Right? Right. It's nothing to worry about, just my brain acting up. That's why my surroundings appear to be different. We knew what the risks were going in as Sentinel pilots. Professor Doji made it all very clear to us. That's right. This has happened before. I experienced a similar illusion during the Sentinel sync test. He's wearing a boy's school uniform, but appears to have a girl's haircut. Hmm. Huh? The hell are you looking at? This one has a particularly strange hairstyle. Hey, you trying to get your ass kicked? 
It looks like I've finally gone crazy. You want to see crazy? Hey, stop! like a detention facility either i'm still seeing things or someone removed me from the sentinel whoever it was brought me to some kind of lab a box-shaped technicolor projection device the sentinel has its own spatial projector as well but that's highly confidential military technology. Uh, it's about baseball. I'm not in a military base, am I? It's a calendar. 1985? It's all in my head. It's just an illusion. Foreign phonograph records. Takatoshi-san used to let me listen to his. Why are there so many records here? There are way more than I saw at the Hijiyamas. Math. Modern Japanese. Lots of textbooks lined up here. Japanese history. So I really am still in Japan, then. This can't be right. 1945. The year of Japan's unconditional surrender. Surrender? We lost the war? 1945. That's this year. August 6th. Atomic bomb dropped on Hiroshima. 140,000 killed. Three days later, second bomb dropped on Nagasaki. 70,000 killed. All from just two new American bombs. What is this book? 1951, U.S.-Japan Security Treaty signed. 1964, Tokyo Olympics? How far does this go? Wait. What did that calendar say? 1985. It has to be fake. When was this printed? It says here... 1985. Could it really be? You okay? Here. <laughs> it's so cold. That's all that was in the fridge. <sighs> <coughs> Not a big fan of soda, I take it? Some kind of carbonated beverage? I had ramen once at a festival in Tsutsuji, but I was just a kid. 1985. Am I still in Japan, but in the future? Who are you? I'm Shu Amiguchi, and we're at my apartment in Kamazumi. Keitaro Miura. So... How did I get here? I called a taxi and brought you over after you got knocked out. So you... helped me? Guilty. You know, you really pushed Ogata over the edge. He was already pissed from being chewed out. If he gets in trouble one more time, he's getting suspended. Be real nice if you two could work things out peacefully. I need to know one thing. What? year is it uh what afraid you got knocked into a coma for the last few years relax you didn't get hit that hard it's still 1985 all right you haven't missed a day 